Well, hello, folks. Welcome along to the 2024 Queensland State Lead Championships Lead Finals. And in reverse order, um, yeah, number one finisher, but they come out in reverse order, eight to one. Here we go. Andy Brown, our first competitor. And um, yeah, yeah, love it. Here we go. All right. Well, let's see what uh, what Andy's got here. I mean, and, even the um, first move, look at that. It's a pull up and then you're straight away crashing yeah. back. Yeah, well... Um, he uh, some big moves early on, so it's nice for them just to get a bit established off the ground and not be too shaky. But I don't think it, uh, I don't think uh, those big holds <laughs> stay for too long. And, and no. these ones here look a little bit more uh, spicy as he gets off the ground. And if you look at home, you see these white holds as well. So for anyone who's not too familiar with the sport, um, you know, like you said, they, they can use all the holds that are available in this zone. Um, they've been sort of coach before you know if there's any areas they have to be smiled but you have to clip up as you go so you have to you can't climb past these clips too far um which is what you got to clip as you go for your safety but basically the thing about lead climbing is it's knowing about how not to rush but also not to dwell too much there's a real finite art to ensuring that you're you're climbing at a steady speed if you hang for too long because this might look vertical to you but you might be 18 degrees overhung here uh, and it's about to, you know, the angle's changing. So his his forearms, his engine, it's all ticking, ticking, ticking like a like a clock. And the longer you spend on a position or in a hold, there you go. Unfortunately, he's, oh. he's gone. I'm lucky, Andy. We're finding out now. We've seen it in our head. But if you watch this move again, his feet look pretty secure. Yeah, just... Oh, what just... was he going for? Victor Hall. Victor's been around the scene for quite a while. And he does a lot of the photography. So if you've ever competed at events in the sport climbing Queensland scene, uh, Victor, there's a good chance Victor snapped a shot of you. Now, he's a, he is a lead specialist. He yep. um not much of a fan of bouldering. He doesn't hide that. Um, he's uh, <laughs> he's lead, lead all the way. So um, I've seen him climb some pretty phenomenal lead routes uh, in our gym. So, um, and, and he's one of the taller climbers, Ian. He must be six foot plus, maybe six two, six two. Sure. <laughs> yeah, yeah, there he is, there he is. He's, yeah, he's, he's, he's definitely six in a few. Yeah, six in a few there. So, but, but looking... But looking very uh, very comfortable so far. But this move saw Andy get into these pinches and really quite quickly um, flame out, which um, mm -hmm. you know. Um, and Victor here, it's hard not, to know how good not, those flames are. Not particularly are. comfortable. Well, again, ooh, ooh, ooh. That, you know, it. yeah. Well, oh, and three bumps up. So wow. Okay. Oh, on, now there's a big ooh, transition time, from. Time. I'd be very interested to see what happens. Oh. Back catch, that little white. Is it a bit of a little mini back catch? He's not going to swap. Oh, height. Yeah, this is where his height's yeah. probably impacting him a little bit. Sometimes it does, doesn't it? Um, oh, just three fingers. Oh. Yeah. Think, okay, what is a crux? Um, it's uh, a section of the climb that might be considered the hardest. So again, a, a, another young young athlete in uh, Big Boss, but mm -hmm. um, yeah, the, like you've seen the, the Denner boys. Um, climb a lot and yeah Boston's, well, I tell you a, what, Boston's a really good climb how old is he now because I remember only a couple of years ago two or three years ago when you you and I started he's really sprouted in the yeah. last couple of years yeah <laughs> yeah I reckon it'd be well, he must be 18 or something yeah, now yeah, but well yeah, I mean yeah. yeah yeah he definitely he definitely well he's looking fit um, let's see if that uh, looks transfers into the uh, uh, competition today it's just about oh. that precision when you hit those when because you've got to obviously they're bringing their body up to, to make the not a weighted arm move, yeah. but you just got to be so precise on the small jibs. And trust me, if you're looking at home, like you're looking and thinking, oh, look at this hole, look how easy it looks. Look at how his hand wraps on on that. You know, it is, it's an open grip. It's a, yeah, you can see that's, that's a fantastic shot there. It's not that open. You know, you yeah. can see the angle of the quick draws, Ian. What about 30? Oh, that, I say, this, now this, that's this, good. That's good. He's got a, a good foot up and a little bit more support here. I don't know if it's going to help him on this move. Oh, oh no way. Oh, <laughs> let's see. Oh, fantastic. Is that it? Oh, yeah, he's got that way. Nice little oh, box. So a little bicycle there. there. Just, yep. Yeah, I'm going to say that was nice. But yep. now he's going to hit these um, these stacks, like dual tech. These, so these have got some more tech barriers. It's amazing. You can't grab them. Yeah, it looks like he needs to make him make his way around yeah. this section as well. A little bit of a... Nice. Nice. He's got both the male and female working these corners. He's going to... I think this is this is going to be uh, yeah. Oh, got a, oh, come on! Oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh wow, that is well, that is. Go. If you you tag me, if you can get past that move, <laughs> um, but yeah, honestly, go have some fun because here we go, AJ, the wild man. <laughs> 
Uh, but yeah, so AJ is a New Zealand athlete. He represented in the Olympic qualifiers for New Zealand. Um, really humble, really nice kid. He's doing um, an Alex Booker. Uh, never get a name. I never say right. I'm top uh, I'll just blame it on my Yorkshireness. But Alex Butcher, um, he's doing her programming. Ah, uh, yeah. Pretty hardcore programming. He's, he's been doing it for about um, six months now. So um, when I last saw him, he said he was really feeling strong from it. Um, and obviously making these finals is, is proof enough straight out of the gate. But um, Yeah, well, coming in in uh, fourth, I think it was. Um, fourth uh, finisher or fourth in the... He, the he can be sometimes, I don't say erratic, because I think like I, I think that's his superpower. is quite dramatic <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> and his climbing uh, style yeah, he, yeah. yeah his style is it seems right like he's fast he's, he's, he's bouncy but he's a really talented young climber and uh, I was saying that he always makes good viewing I guess is what I would say <laughs> and um, <laughs> I hope that there's certain climbers who, who really you, like every move they've almost fallen off oh, no! oh my gosh oh, oh, yeah, didn't yeah. look that. so next one out is going to be uh, Malo um, and uh, um, Svezotsky, and I've asked him a million times. I never get his name either. Alex <laughs> Sev Svetkovsky. Is Svetkovsky. Next one. So Malo, go, yeah. Malo Gilly, and and, and um, Alex, they're two very different type of climbers. You've got to see these two go out, and I'll be interested to see if they can both get through that crux or one or the other, because they climb very different ways. So let's see how Malo gets on here. He's uh, well, it'll be great to see if we can get uh, get something, um, you know, up through that section. We've only seen really the bottom third section, or maybe the bottom half of the the men's lead here. Um, and I would, uh, I would expect. Um, I, I think Marlo Mike's is such a, a, a graceful climber, but I would expect um, to see Alex because of the power. I think that move and his finger strength will be, you know, when it hits them them stacks white jewel text dishes. Yeah. Uh, lenses he'll be, he'll be in a great spot so let's see and and um yeah i think um you know up through this section you can see how steep it is and you know if you can conserve some energy through this section here uh and not really and that's great the the high heel look i think that sort of yeah. holds him in a little bit uh but now it's all about just trusting the rubber on the transfer exactly yeah. trust it know yeah. it's good is there a little there might be a little thing on the underneath that top yeah. as well because sure. it looks like he's got right hand on the chip there walk on it as well Ah, uh, looking Good comfortable here. And, yeah, he's um, in Malo, so, so look at that. So precise. Now, take your time. Now, this nice. is a terrible hold. The next one's good, but this one is terrible. Um, maybe a heel. And I, we I, saw I, Boston we, hit that ball and slip twice. So is he going to try and keep the toe for the tension? No, he has to maybe, yeah, I was going to say heel on this, maybe, because the toe wasn't such such That's a great Boston one. slipped, though. His toe went up to go. Oh, no, he's got... Look at that body. Nice body position. Like a how-to yep. video, isn't it? There you go. Now you can see his body, he, he, he pulled his body around Ian and didn't leave it underneath. And mm -hmm. that gave him a really nice, solid, direct line straight up to the hole. Didn't have to move his body And that too much. second one's a beautiful yeah. hole. Yeah. Now he's in a good position. But again, so he's got your current high point. So he is your clubhouse leader, as they say. Um, let's see how he does. I'm going to put back on Oh, talk again. Nice. A little Matt. bit of... Oh, oh. That, yeah. see, that did look the absolute garbage. That is the wrong. <laughs> wow. Nice. Right. Well, let's see if he can build yeah, this in. In the dish, hips in. Wow. Okay. So that black is super positive. It looks like... It looks like he might need to go out out into that, maybe. Or... It's a big undercut, like, undercut. Oh, okay. It's really so, hard to tell. So you can see that... Uh, that long draw from the roof, there's a yes. blue triangle there. We might get a different shot and you'll be able to see it. But um, yeah, you still can't see it as good as you wanted. But it uh, looks yeah, like he'll, he'll be hit that edge, traversing yeah. off on that edge on a couple of small jibs. So so. It, might, it might be a toe hook on the black and bump your hands across the jibs. It does look we'll like see. it. Well, it's a spicy looking move, folks. And, um, yes. you know, so far so good for Marlo. Looking on, pretty man. good, but, um, you know, just needs to get into this section. Oh, yeah. See, yeah, you can see there it is. Yep. Now, oh, oh, nice. Now, I wonder if it's a cross screw because he does need to go out really far away with his left. At this point, I'd be wrapping about chicken nuggets to keep my sanity <laughs> because I would be absolutely like, this look, it's so good. Come nice. on. Nice. All right. So it looks comfortable, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. It does. But it's a, a big left out there on that jib. Yeah, there's nice. that here, the toe hook. Yeah, yeah that's the thing. He's, I tell you what. He's really utilised the toe hooking in this in this climb. Looking good. Elbows up a little bit here, but um, still... Found a good spot to recharge. Yeah. Just shake out a little bit here. 
Swap. Wings. Gotta find something there. Wow, this is doing, impressive. Doing impressive. Big right heel because out to heel, the right. There's a heel back on yeah. the left. Then there's another bump into the right. There you go. Absolutely looking fantastic. Starting to burn a little bit here, but uh, uh, let's think, see if he yeah. does the plus. In the next one. Yeah. Oh. So like we said earlier, again, if you just yeah. watching, that's quite an important move to show the security on that first hold and generate that movement off. There's there. the plus move, so that's a smart move in, in the competition, like Ian said. So yeah, well done. Him. Here's Alex. Alex out now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here we go. The boulder trip to uh, South Africa soon, Rocklands. But yeah. Alex here on the on the wall, um, just powering through. Yeah, he's, 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 I think he's going to move at some speed. He's pretty slick. We saw with Tiana, though, like I think like the reason Tiana progressed was every clip she hit, perfect. Cool. Clip fast, cool. moved on, yeah. prime position, and that's what helped her get around there. Clear took a tiny bit longer with them, but um, that's why she battled more. But again, current high point leader. Yeah. You see Alex is a little bit shorter, so we'll have to – these first few moves are going to be a bit more springy. Well, it was you know, pretty well that, that first – that the one he's standing on, the first two holds decent, decent enough, and then the rest of them really just just kicked in here quite quickly, like um, you know, opening a uh, um, opening a a uh, you know a cold um, yeah, opening a cold window on a uh, on a yeah. uh, winter's day. <laughs> it's like a blast of cold, yeah. cold, uh, cold air in the face. But anyway, he's, yeah, he's doing quite nicely here. It is, it is zero to a hundred, and I think that's yeah, that's so good. But um, yeah, no, it's um, yeah, like I said, I, it, when you see a climber who's just read it correctly, like look how he's hit that handrail, um, and then yeah, heel in, it's just just jumped for a just. Wow, just did that with a with an undercling, and really wasn't even on that jib either. So yeah, no, I don't think a... he's seen the jib. <laughs> oh, oh no. good hit mobility. Now yeah, just use yep. the jib. Oh, there's oh, there, got the jib. There he's got is. the jib. There it is. Come on. So this is where Malo had that benefit of that bit yeah, reach. So he hit the next yeah. one and then he double-handed oh. straight away. So hit the double straight. There we go. Now you can read it. And Malo again went toe hook, toe hook. I think yet yeah, toe hook's there. Good. Nice. Then I would have fucked there. Yeah. Oh. Look at him hit. That's the thing. Is that hip flexibility. It's like Luke Beat trust these guys who oh. can just win. Oh, my God. No, he needs to make the trip. He can't climb further than yeah, past the knee. That's phenomenal. Um, He's made the clip, which is good news. Wow, that's a, that's yeah, a fantastic that's really good fight. Yeah. Right. Oh! oh. <laughs> wow. There you go. I'll tell he you what. He's going yep. to this, yeah. Yep. He, uh, he put in a bit of a fight there at the end as well, which is great. So, um, yeah. So, yep. still Marlow with that impressive top spot there, yeah. Well, Marlow, smooth all the way through. Really, it, you know, yeah. it, it, I, we didn't see him make a, a wrong move. Um, he just ran out of steam at the end and yeah. only just, but, um, you know, here, I wonder you know, Alex, he went for the underclean, yeah, he, the he, foothold. He went yeah. the back end and yeah, I mean, this is where, you know, just maybe you know, getting a bit pumped and, and then when you're pumped, yeah, you, your brain starts to think all sorts of weird things. <laughs> so Louis out next. Nice to see him back come. Yeah. Um, let's we'll see how he goes. Cause he, he smashed it yes, uh, earlier. Well, did, did everyone else have to jump then? And maybe they didn't. Uh, anyway. Andy Brown jumped and yeah. so did um, Alex. But, yeah, the yeah. rest just stepped up. Again, sign of confidence, right? Yeah. And, yeah. again, you come through in second by only Sam Lavender, who was one hold away from an Olympic. Well, he was six seconds away from an Olympic berth, basically. Yes. In the ball when, when Campbell did the spectacular lead send. But Sam was in first coming out of Baldwin. Yeah, that was uh, that was a fantastic one. If you want to go see something amazing, that was a tearjerker, actually. Yeah, the the, uh, the, the, the send. qualifiers, yeah, Campbell Sand was absolutely amazing. But right yeah. now, we've got Louis on the yeah, wall. Yeah, yep. not, let's not... see if Louis can pull a Campbell. Yeah, I was going to say, I don't <laughs> want to detract from uh, from Louis here, but yeah, that was. I think every one of us was um, emotional watching Campbell. Do it. So come on, Louis, give us a top, give us another screen moment. I mean, he is swift and looking very comfortable right now. Yeah, fantastic. So well, this is a terrible hold again. If you're just tuning in, this is where like half the athletes fell. We've only seen Marlow and Alex just, get past here. Just got to get himself around. Yeah, this He's is trusting where that, that heel a bit much, and that heel is garbage. Remember? Yeah, that you gotta, body you gotta, position. You know, you've got to hit that. Oh, good. Oh. He's very poppy. Very poppy. Two hands on it now. Now twist the hips. It's just uh, yeah. He yeah he, he well he's climbed, motored he to this like section. Yeah he yeah he's like motored to this section. So let's see if he. Uh, he's going to clip from here. Yeah. Those, those white ones, I've, I've crimped on those before and they're not 
They're not so great. <laughs> no, yeah, I was going to say they're beautiful looking holes, but they're not yeah. the. They the bite, most but they're friendly. small. They yeah. bite, but they're small. Yeah. All right, let's see if he can uh, make his way up into this roof section and still have enough energy just to, you know, get himself in position. Come because. On, Come on, fella. So he's got to read this right way. He's got to hit the clip and then come back out to that blue volume. Yeah, move and, back it to the and right. And this is the thing is, if you haven't really seen it, they go, go. Mean, like, I think Alex had just forgotten oh. about that and he'd just gone, like, blinkers on, as they say in, I guess, horse racing. But he's, you know, he just saw the black hole and he's drawn to it. Yeah, it looks like he's a bit stretched out here. Like, yeah, so. Not quite oh, as tall. Just. Not, oh, just in yeah. bump. Just in bump. On. There we go. Come on. She's going to work it like a drain oh. pipe. Oh. Yeah. Second though, for this one. well done. Yeah. Well done. Well, he, he, he did fantastically there. Just um, just that section was maybe a little bit reachier. Yeah, and yeah. look, a tiny bit of a less known name, but um, he, he, you won't forget him swiftly. And uh, it's good to see him. Yeah, mixing up. We can see some support from the community. He's going and trying these climbs. Absolutely. Well, I see Big Sam. Big oh, Sam, our number one uh, finisher in the qualifiers, and arguably. Um, in the driving seat here for for this uh, for this competition, I mean, if we it, were it's all his to win. Yeah, if we were nationally ranking, you would say he's one of the top you know free lead climbers in the country quite comfortably. Um, you know the way we've seen him perform the last two years for a young man, and um, yeah, he was in the Olympic qualifiers. He was second to Campbell, who is now on the World Cup tour, about to hit the the Olympics this year with Oceana, and um, yeah. Like Sam has got massive mitts and an absolute <laughs> reach. Uh, he's a beautiful route set as well. He was set for a lot of these comps last year or the year before. He took time to set for a lot of the competitions. And that sort of insight in knowing how the routes are put together does help you as a climber. Oh, and he's got quite a span by the look of it too. So uh, yeah, yeah, big big reach, big hands. Now up. that's a really nice. That's a really nice angle. Seeing Mike coming around that corner. Just a fantastic shot there. You he know? shouldn't be allowed to climb yeah. with those baseball gloves on. <laughs> <laughs> it catches me. He's got the yellow drag on. Well, yeah. just got on orange one. Well, have yeah, a look yeah. at the angle of his ankle there. You know, he's got a real sort of um, you know, heel hook just cammed in there. If my ankle's ever yeah. in that position, call me an ambulance. Because, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I can't twist. Now, I will... now he's, he's, he's locked into this section, but hasn't you know, worked out how to unlock himself. I think he's got to get Yeah, yeah he's got to. Yeah, he's not wanting to use that bad bib. There you go. Just yeah. It. yeah, I just saw the. I was just talking to someone about the new climbing shoes coming out. You know, there's a big snow hill push at the moment. And there's uh, the Mad Rock Shack Free coming out. Um, and Scarpa has done this. Come on, Sam. Oh. He, he was looking good. very no, 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 Sam. Oh. 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 And then the toe hook's just not there. Yeah, he lost. It, his right foot came away. And uh, it really just uh, quite convincingly, Marlo, 28 plus. Ooh. And we've got Louis and Alexander there in second and third at this moment in time. Let's give it up one more time for our Queensland podium for open A male lead.